All I did was mew. I was living in a Buddhist monastery all the time, and I simply meditated several hours a day with my tongue pressed firmly onto the roof of my mouth. Actually, the Buddha instructs that while meditating, you keep the tongue pressed firmly on the roof of your mouth. What I found was that as soon as I took a little bit of awareness away from my mewing, it collapsed. And this is what happens when your oral volume is insufficient to allow you to mew. You can't do it habitually. You can force it for a while, but as soon as it's no longer the primary focus of your attention, it collapses. And so for two years, I tried mewing my mouth bigger unsuccessfully. I didn't expand the bone one bit. I did strengthen my tongue, strengthen some of my facial muscles, but I did not move the bone one bit because I was not able to mew in my sleep or in any of my down moments where I wasn't directly focusing on it. So I might have been mewing intensely, let's say 10 or 15% of the day, but the other 80 to 85% of the day, I was essentially doing nothing.